welcome back to the channel yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. hello guys welcome to this video so today's video is going to be a what I've used up video I never really know how to name some of the videos like used up products I guess you could say I've accumulated a small batch of items that I've recently used up and I thought I'd share them with you guys that way you to know my honest opinion about them real quick like a brief description and if or not I will be repurchasing them now that they're all used up but let's go ahead and see what's in my basket or my little bowl here of all my used up products so the first product I have here is my Too Faced Hangover RX face primer this product is I want to say a nice moisturizing face primer did it keep my face all like mattified no was it its purpose not really I guess you could say but I've never had a problem with a face primer not leave it mattified and this one definitely did not do that but overall it was a nice moisturizing primer it did act as a moisturizer and a face primer the only thing I didn't like about it was the fact that it because it has a moisturization in it if you want to make your face more mattified or you want your face <laughs> if you want your face to be less oily this product is not the best product for you I want to say I want to say this is not for all skin types because it has the moisturization in it which kind of keeps it a little glowy when you're trying to make it matte if you know what I mean would I buy it again honestly probably not it was a little too expensive okay so the next product I have is disgustingly dirty and gross but this is my um, who's this by again lush lush fresh homemade cosmetics this is the let the good times roll face scrub oh I actually didn't finish it all I guess it was leftovers but it had expired so I didn't finish it all but this particular product was amazing would I repurchase it absolutely I don't know why I haven't purchased it yet honestly surprisingly I haven't gone back and repurchased it there is not a close by lush near me uh, I don't even know where the nearest one is because I got this in Vegas I know there's ones near me I just haven't gone and when I do I'm for sure getting this because this stuff is amazing so this product is actually made with polenta um, and also yeah wait for it wait what what salt popcorn I know I was a little surprised too I was like what the heck why is there popcorn in my facial wash or scrub this is weird but pretty much this gently exfoli can I talk please this gentle exfoliating maize and polenta cleanser with an absolutely scrumptious sweet and salty popcorn scent to soft and smooth skin so that's what it says um, it's supposed to do and stuff and it totally does it and my face feels literally soft like a freaking baby's bottom okay so this next product is one I've used before this is a Maybelline master fix face translucent uh, powder setting perfecting loose powder I love this stuff I've actually never tried any other face setting powder and I've always wanted to try the Laura Mercier one because everyone says that one's like amazing but I just can't see myself spending that much money on it unless it was gifted to me hint 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 Christmas kind of around the corner but yeah this one was pretty good I used up every single little drop that's in here there's literally like nothing left except for I guess what's in the little crevices here I guess or whatever it is a perfect inexpensive product for setting your face if you are baking if you are just trying to mattify if you are oily and need something to kind of you know dust your face and make it not so shiny and greasy this will do the job so this one I do recommend okay so this next one is like my absolute favorite product I buy this one all the time I want to say it lasts me about a month and then I have to repurchase it because a little goes a long way this is the Swarovskoff repair rescue sealed ends product I I'm obsessed with this product. I love it so much. I literally just take about a dime to a nickel size and put it on my mid length to ends. Mostly just my ends though because that's what it's specifically for. Kind of helps take these damaged ends of mine and split ends and mend them to make them look decent and kind of repair it. What could be repaired. Um, and then it just honestly just makes it feel really really soft and smooth and I really really like it. And on top of that it smells amazing. Okay, now like I said this is a short video so I only have two more left. But this product you're going to be like what? not really a product but it's beauty related this is my hairbrush you guys I got this hairbrush literally like five years ago I want to say and it's lasted me this long it is the best brush ever like ever if I could recommend any brush to you guys it would be one like this um, I don't know if it's the brand or if it's just the type of style it is I want to say it's a style hopefully all the brands that have this style are just as good but it is like a curved brush so as you can see it has this curvature here which like curves perfectly to your head when you place it on there and for some reason it just like helps to detangle it better also the bristles are nice and long so when they go onto your head they're actually <laughs> when they go onto your head they're actually going to detangle your entire hair 
part that you're trying to detangle, not just the top part, like all those other two brushes. But yeah, I pretty much just <laughs> used this completely up and this was by, I think the brand was like Diva or something. And if I could recommend it to you guys, I would totally recommend it right now to you guys. Go purchase it or any kind of brush that has like that curvature go get it so we are down to the last product for today's video this is my l'oreal true match foundation and i only recently started using actual liquid foundation just a few months ago actually because right i want to say i say a few months ago it's been like half a year i guess since january i got a beauty blender for christmas and i was like you know what i really want to try a liquid foundation because why not i want my face to look super, super soft and nice I was using Bare Minerals before and it was totally drying out out of nowhere. I used to use it for years and all of a sudden my skin was just not liking it. So I decided to try this one out and the color I use I think is like W3. Yeah, W3. And I really, really, really like it. I highly recommend it to you guys if you guys want an inexpensive facial product. I haven't really had too much experience in other products out there, but I would definitely be willing to try them um, once I use up my new one that I just got because this one's obviously old. I did purchase a new one. It kind of looks cool but I promise you it's not. It is empty, unfortunately. All right, guys, so that sums it up for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did like it, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Hit that notification bell if you guys want to get notified on the next video that I do post. And subscribe if you guys aren't subscribed already to see more videos like this. I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.